Hi. Hello. Hello. Welcome. Welcome back for another installment of Trial by Fear. I just ate way too much chili. That's going to describe... If the vibe on this one is a little bit different than usual, it's the chili. Rachel made chili last night. Ate the chili last night. There was still chili in the fridge this morning. Had me like an 11 a.m. bowl of chili. And I'm regretting it, I'll be honest. Didn't regret that good flavor. But I regret the bad feeling. Today we're, uh, we got a lot to do, actually. Got a lot on our to-do list. Got, um... Well, let's consult. Let's consult the map. Uh, it's the map. It's the map. Yeah, I mean, a lot of stuff. We can go visit the magic bat, finally. Uh, we got a bunch of stuff down in the southwest quadrant. First things first, though. I'm gonna go wake up a bird. Yeah, uh, I would say more than any food that exists on the Earth, chili has sort of determined the energy of more podcast, rec podcast recordings and video streams and whatever that's stuff I've done. I need to tighten it up, though. Because I can't go to one of these little blobby octopus boys and say, sorry, can you guys go slower? Because I just had chili. They, it doesn't work like that. All right. I'm gonna die. I was adjusting my seat. What if this episode, I just came up with, um... Uh, a bad excuse for every single death. Fuck you. Why is there a pterodactyl in this game? Why is there a pterodactyl in this game? I'll take my answer off the air. Thriller than I remember it being. Is there a lore reason why that bird got statued? Uh, let's ask the chat. Hey, chat. Should I go to the desert temple in the light world or the... Swamp Palace in the Dark World. It's up to you. <laughs> Let me put a little spice in the gazpacho. Makes sense to me. Thanks for spicing up my gazpacho. Swamp, 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 swamp. Wow, okay, swamp. We're doing swamp. We're gonna Shrek it up in today's episode. Uh, maybe I should just... Dope. How are we doing? Full up on them, on the green stuff. Bird up. Mm. 
That was not necessary. Uh, do I have to drain this before I can, like, actually... I think so, right? But I have to... I don't know. I know I have to have, like, the portal here, which I can do now because I have the magic mirror, and... It's a... It's a... So much stuff happened in the last episode. Uh, there's a... Yeah. There's a laser boy over there, which I don't like. Lift that, okay. Please, please lift it. Thank you. I just instinctively see those little spinny red. I don't like how they make me feel. I'm not gonna like how that makes me feel either. I guarantee it. I've been playing a lot of Elden Ring in the last like three days and I don't know if that's gonna be helpful or hurtful because my nerves are already sort of in the trash can. I'm gonna die? No, I'm not. How am I liking Elden Ring? I think it's the best, the best game? It's really very, very good. Um, I think about it while I'm not playing it. I think about my, my great guy and all of his incredible stuff that he's got. Drain the floodgate to raise the water. Yeah, thank you. Do those blue things actually hurt your body? I suppose we'll find out, because one of them will hit me eventually. Am I having frame rate issues? So I'm playing on PC with Elden Ring, not with Link to the Past. It would be wild if I was having frame rate. You know what? Actually, in Zora's River, I was having some frame rate issues with Link to the Past, so I shouldn't be so quick to dismiss that. Uh, I get like weird hiccups where it just kind of like freezes for a little bit um, in Elden Ring every once in a while. Wow, Red Rupee's the order of the day. Um, which is unfortunate, it's not, it's not nearly enough to like, impact my experience, unless I'm, uh, you know, trying to go hog wild on a boss and then the game freezes for like a half a second. That's no good. Wow, that thing, uh, that thing goes hard. There it is. I feel like I know this temple really well. Oh, that shouldn't have, that really seemed like it was gonna hit that block, right? Everyone, that wasn't just me. Okay. I'm gonna blame that one on the chili too. Blame it on the chit it, 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 elite. Okay, so the little bubbles do hurt your body. Beans or no beans? There was beans. I see a lot of people saying we should do a monster factory on Elden Ring. That's a pretty good idea. We should uh, really think about that. I hope everybody likes that uh, wet foot sound effect, because you're going to hear it a lot. Oh, that's right. That only moves. That only shoots when I attack. Oh, that's annoying. Oh, that's annoying. What an annoying room.
I should have gotten that fairy. Why did I not get that fairy? I love laser sword. Far, this seems pretty much just like the Swamp Temple. Not a lot of silly stuff so far on this one. That's okay. Every time I have to go down there, it's gonna be pretty, pretty rough, pretty rough ride, huh? That's nothing. Uh, so I have the hook shot, so I think I can like skip a portion of this temple. Okay, so I love that that one didn't give me red rupees, but it did give me 20 rupees, which is the amount of rupees that a red rupee gives you. like that. That's a lot of those, huh? More than is the normal amount. A 20 green rupee means it was a tunic upgrade? I have gotten no new tunics. Um, so there is a logic to that. Although I don't know what a new tunic would look like on Mr. On Mr. Fieri. Okay, that's one way. I wanna kill that guy so I can get some Oh, no. Never mind. I won't be killing that man today. There are still so many things I don't understand about this game. And that's great. For me. I will take any 
bank error in my favor that this game will give me, but holy shit. I pr oh, God. My least favorite thing, this is gonna sound like another excuse, but I promise it's not, because it's like the 50th time it's happened since I started doing this series, is that sometimes like when you come out of a door or when you get out of water or whenever you're in some sort of like transitory state, uh, you'll press the Y button to like activate your item and it won't really, won't really get you there. Won't really recognize it. Or maybe I'm just trash. That is always, always a possibility. Just kind of resetting them. Oh, they can turn? They can turn. Those ones turn. I forgot to check how many treasure chests. There are six non-dungeon treasures in here. So far, I have found one or two. I really, really, really have to be better about that. The good news is I can burn through my magic now because we have the, the flute. And we can go visit the witch in like half a second. What was I? What was I thinking? Oh. I'm going to be thinking about that shadow that I somehow just breezed past for the rest of the day. Anytime I give this game shit for not being fair, I'm going to think about that time that it gave me one. All right, I'm not going to get... I thought that dude was about to come out in the fucking water and have a little pool party. I have to check and see if that's anything. It's not, but... Oh, he would have come out to have a pool. That's great. They're just sort of dying right away, huh? I should not have come here. I mean, when they spawn right in on you, what are you going to do? This one is, um, I predict this will be a shorter dungeon. Man, I say that. It depends on what the boss is, huh? Because that boss run is going to be not terribly pleasant. I think it's going to be shorter, but I also think that it's gonna, there's going to be a lot of hot dogs that we're going to make along the way. No, fortunately the water does not reset when you pass away. Okay, so now I know not to go down that alleyway. Man, it's taking me like one bottle of magic per per run. Oh, come on. Oh, I guess those instantly die because they don't like being on land. Which makes sense. They're drippy drops.
Yowza. There's a lot of... There's a lot of wild boys in this room, huh? Do I have one more? Oh, that was my last one, huh? Oh, I don't want to do that! Is there anything over here? I think the right one is the right way to go, but... My body's telling me to check this one first. Oh, for a moment like this, some people wait a lifetime. What a long, strange journey it has been. This game just got a lot more tolerable. <laughs> that dude's just like, I'll see you on the next screen, brother. Where's the... Oh, there it is. Yeah! All right. Uh, let me think. Yeah, I need to hit that switch and then go back there, huh? That's annoying. Now. <laughs> I'm gonna die so many times because of these dumb boots. All right, I'm gonna go get some magic. Let me get some magic, it'll be real quick. Bird up! I think, am I? Can I beat the game? No, I have to get all the crystals, yes. There we go. Thank you! Man, everyone will fill you up. Roller is treacherous. Oh, do I really have to? That is annoying. I, like, there's nothing I... I mean, I would love to get me some silver arrows. The, uh, the Ganon killing ones. Again, love to activate my items. Love to lose my laser sword for no reason. Now I can run. Alright, uh... Think. 
Nope. Oh. Yeah, I need to learn what I am invincible to, invincible to, toward when I am sprinting. Most, a lot of things, right? If you reach Ganon without silver arrows, he will tell you how to find him. That's weirdly nice of him. I hope I have enough magic. I do. Set the switch back. I did. I. Wait, did I switch it? Wrong switch state. Blew up. Blew up. Thank you, everybody. I'm sorry I'm like this. It's the- it's this damn chili! One hit's not enough for those, though, when you do it with the laser sword. One is not enough for those. I should have saved scum that one. I think I just wasted a bottle. Don't tell me I've got the map left on when I don't. I don't need that kind of stress in my life. Thank you very much. I will, I will be incompetent on my own time. Thank you very much. Okay, I just don't need to hit the switch, everyone is reminding me. And I appreciate that. I love that. That's great. Prescription refill at Walgreens that I will need to tend to. So, is this going to be a big key or a regular key or 20 fucking rupees or? Well, huh. I know at some point there's like... At some... Ah, fuck me, that one went down, huh? Fuck, wow, shoot, darn, crap. I look like I grocery shop from Walgreens. I don't know what that means. Feels a little classist, if I'm being honest. What, I just wasted so much, so much of the green. There we go. You can't drink nothing. I was trying to huff air out of that bottle. That's four non-dungeon chests, thank you. Uh, one of these is like something, thank you, yes, cool. 
Great. Good. I'm guessing this is where I, I'm really, uh... The order that things have been so far in this dungeon are, is mystifying to me. Oh, shit! Yeah, I don't... Ah, shit! Is this something? One of these tongues does something. Not that tongue, though. Not that. Wait, can I pull? Can I pull this? I can't pull this. Well, I went the wrongest... The wrongest possible way. downstairs we'll find out this is a pretty stressy little dungeon okay ass Switch turns into a little nubbin after you press it. You know what? I shouldn't judge the nubbin switch. It's it's doing its best. He just comes right back, huh? Infinite fairies hack! That poor little blue guy's on his own little journey. Okay. Oh, shit. Sh shit, shoot. Thank God that they can't walk on where pots used to be. Just go get... I have two green potions left, but I'm about to use one. This takes like three seconds. I'm gonna go do it again. Yeah, that sucks. That's a bad beat, everyone. I'm was I wasted your time on that one. I, I do apologize. Word up. This is a this is an expensive dungeon. I will never 
I will never be sad about getting a bunch of rupees again. Push the third block, they say. Seems like a trick to me. Where am I? What am I even doing? Where do I get off going the wrong way? That gate is the scariest thing in this game. There's a lot of questions I have about the infrastructure of Link to the Past Era Hyrule. I forgot to get those kisses to fully heal. That's okay. There's like a million fairy opportunities in this dungeon. All right. Let's stop wasting magic. Don't need it. I live on the edge. Where even the hell was I? Got the map. Let's see. Who are we squaring off against this time? Eyeball got... Is that right? I thought I already did him. Isn't he the boss of this dungeon? Like the real ass. I thought I already did him. Huh. Oh well. Did I not already do him? Yeah, I definitely did, Eyeball Guy. Do I have to push that thing again? But I am gonna go zap this fairy. Pretty sure. Well, yeah, sure. Yeah, all right. Oh yeah, I should see if there's. I have the compass, right? So the compass should show me if there's treasure chests too. Maybe I don't actually know if that's how it works in this game. Boss Shuffle can have multiple copies of bosses. All right. Well, I stomped his ass the first time around, so. Listen to me, listen to how cocky I've gotten. I think I've cleared out the rest of this dungeon. I think this way that I'm going now is like the only way to go. Let's see if I can actually do that this time without. I don't actually want to kill those guys. I just want you. Now I want to kill those guys, but that's just for me. That's that's just for vengeance's sake. I'm just banking on the fact that it has, that switch is still down. Because that's how it's worked for the other ones, right? Yes. No, okay. And I already went down, yeah? What was down? Yeah, I'm going up this time. Uh, and 
I'm gonna move the third rock from the sun. So all that should be left is the boss drop, yeah? I'm not trying to get killed by one of those blippies. I don't want to get killed by child's YouTube entertainer blippy. Come here. See, what I used to do in this room is I used to just drop one of these on him. I may as well. I have very little blippy exposure. Uh, Henry is much more into um, songs written about Minecraft, a game that he does not play. All right, let's top off. And we hook shot and I, I Whoa, he's red. Holy shit. That's a little bit more intense. Oh. 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 Well, I guess so. Oofa doofa. So there's a second eyeball guy? But this one does lightning? Get in the water. Make me so mad sometimes. Fairy juice. Come here. Gotta do my trigonometry to figure out where he's gonna bounce. This uh this eyeball guy seems like a a much tougher pill to swallow. This is, I think, the only room that I really am going to need the magic to get through reliably. He always leaves. He always says, catch you later, man. I don't want to mess with you. I've seen what you've done. off here it is somewhat delightful that I do not have the bug catching net all right uh, so I don't need the I don't need the hook shot then right because I couldn't even really hook shot those little eyes 
That ziggy ass looking boss icon. The laser sword also does nothing. And I'm guessing if the eyeballs touch me, I'm also going to die. This one's gonna be bad then, huh? Oh man. Bow. Yeah, the bow's probably good for this one, huh? The boss has a pretty easy telegraph with the lightning bolts, so I feel pretty confident that Thims isn't gonna zap me again. But those eyeballs are very, um. Very spicy. Sorry, somebody just referenced the Ben Stein Visine commercials and it made me turn 200 years old. It turned me into a 200 year old mummy man. Anybody else wanna reference some, some great late 90s commercials that are gonna put me in my grave? Y'all are referencing some, some where's the beef. I remember the Quiznos with the weird squirrels that was like, some ad exec was like, hey guys, have you heard about these memes? Lightning won't strike you in the top left or top right of the room. I don't know if I believe you or not, but I'm not worried. I think this will go better. I got the, I got, I'm gonna use my bow and arrow this time and everyone's gonna like, just die. Someone's in there talking about soccer boppers. That was a, uh, that was a kid's weapon that they sold. It was like a pillow fight, but more violent. What have I created in this fucking chat room? Oh, I can just light them up. This is, this is a little stressful. It also feels like it's gonna take a hundred years. Oh, fuck! I didn't notice, I didn't notice. Yeah, I don't think bow and arrow was as effective as I thought it was gonna be. Don't use the bow till the big eye comes out. Cape and sword spin the little ones. It's not a bad strategy. How long have we been going? 50 minutes? Has that honestly hasn't felt like that long. A lot of the time on Fieri, the opposite is true. It feels like we've been going forever. Not this time though. Oh! Trying to be, trying to be, uh, trying to save up my, my juice on that one. Man, if that is how bad this one's going, here's, here's, everybody's telling me, saying, Griffin, aren't you nervous about how bad Ganon's gonna be? But Ganon, you don't gotta run back to. Ganon, you just jump in a hole and let him kill you over and over again. 
I'm not looking forward to Ganon's Tower or whatever it's called. The last dungeon of the game where there's like 50 chests and it's like 20 floors high and it takes you forever to get to the top again. That one I'm not stoked for. I'm just going to make... Okay, double check. Why not use blue staff? It's a good question. I'm sure I've got a great answer. So if memory serves, the blue staff is cheaper to use over time. The cape is cheaper to use in short bursts. It's always just gonna be hearts. I'll try blue staff this time. Blue staff does have a casting class, yes, I know. Alright. But wait! Blue staff can cancel damage. Someone told me this, that blue staff, if something registers a hit from the blue staff, it may not pick up when your much stronger sword does a much stronger spin attack. So we're going to do K. I just have to not be dookie, awful garbage. And also, remember to jump in there. Yeah, I can just get right up in his shit. Hit him! I mean, he pops his little, his little head out. So what are those last four eyeballs gonna do then? Yeah, I made that much harder than it needed to be, huh? We are doing great, 20 rupees wise. Am I good? Was that six? It feels like that was six treasures. We'll take it. I think that was my last treasure chest in there. I want to make sure before I get all excited to move on. Yep, okay. Uh, so now I can... Now I can fly... down to Desert Town. Let's see what's popping over there. Because I think I can get into the desert temple with the magic mirror and not need the book or whatever. I have that one. What's this? I found a secret little alcove. 
rich with possibilities. Nope. A lot of people all confirming my desert suspicions. Where do I where do I need to boop though? Is this it? Kinda. Gotta knock out that check. All right, I bet I can blaze through here. You like that? You like how I just remember? It's been so long since I played this game. Oh, well, I mean. One of these has like a key in it. Oh, actually, let's check this. Okay, there's only two non-dungeon chests in this room. So let's just get through here real quick. I don't actually need to beat here. Beat beat this here temple. I love the light world dungeon music so much more than the dark world dungeon music. I don't have the right thing for that. I may as well. Well, that's... The heart is not a dungeon item. So that's one. Is there a Master Sword check? I guess so. But like, if I'm good to go for... I'm good to go for Ganon's Tower right now. Yowza! Got me. Tip of that almost got me, Odell. All right. Where did he come from? I know will kill me. The little zappy, little zappy boys. Yeah, I'm not trying to 100% this one hit kill Fieri randomizer. I'm good. Sure. 
I think I can just dash through here and be okay. But I don't know for sure. What's this? What's all this in? Blah. It's just a fun way of screwing up your checkpoint. are invincible when you're dashing, huh? Is this not, where's the master, the big key? Thank you, the McElroy family chat uh, in YouTube just shared links because we're going on tour again with Mbim Bam and Taz to a city near you, maybe. Go to bit.ly slash McElroy Tours and join us. We're gonna make people wear masks and shit. I'm good, I'm done, I'm out. Where's this checkerboard thing that everyone's... I need to go outside for that, I believe. over there. Do I have to mirror? I guess I have to mirror. This feels good. Want to get it off my off my tracker? Okay. There's not some other secret thing in here, is there? No. All right. Uh. I mean, if those are uh, yeah, those are the only two. Those are the only two items in there. So I think I'm done with that dungeon. Which leaves just one more dungeon. What time is it? I should probably wrap up. In a minute. I'll see what is in this big monster mouth. Can you refill my magic? What good are you? Thank you for reminding me to get my prescription. I do appreciate that. I 
I will circle back to that dungeon if on the off chance that the Master Sword check, which I would need the pendant for, is like is the silver arrows. But I'm not gonna I'm not gonna do that for no reason. What am I doing? I need to stop playing. I need to stop playing. I have other things I need to do. I'm gonna I'm gonna restart. So I'm not confused. Okay. We're staying right here. We're gonna say goodbye. Thank you all for watching. We'll be back next week. Uh, that's a good omen. This temple's gonna go great for us when we actually play it in a week. Uh, thank you all. We'll we'll be back next week. Come come see us on tour. DC and Detroit and Cincy, we're coming for you in like two weeks. So get there. Um, but that's it. Thanks for watching. I think I'm close. I think I'm gonna beat. I think I'm gonna beat this. I think this is. I think I'm gonna win. I think I'm, I think I'm the best at Zelda ever.